Hey YouTube, I'm Miss Natural Life. Thank you for stopping in on my channel. Today I'm going to give my first impressions of the Nubian Heritage Hair Care line. Um, if you saw my Unlucky 13 video or I think video 14 where I did a mini haul, I got a few of the Nubian Heritage products on a BOGO sale at my local Walgreens a couple of weeks ago. Um, my hair has been kind of, mm, I don't know, just going through its own little, you know, phase right now um, and I was expressing in that those videos that I was just like I don't know I was at wit's end with my hair I didn't know what I was doing what in the world was going on whether it was the weather or just a phase I didn't know so I decided that I wanted to try some of the products so today I want to give you my first impression um, it's only been a couple of weeks since I purchased these products and since I've been using these products so this isn't like my final final review but it is just how I'm feeling I found out was that the Nubian Heritage line is the sister company to Shea Moisture and we all know if you've seen any of my videos I love Shea Moisture I love that their products are natural and they work well for my hair and my skin so I was excited when I saw the Nubian Heritage line um, because basically Shea Moisture was promoting them on Facebook and uh, I decided to check them out. And so first the um, Grow and Strengthen Treatment Mask. This is the first thing that I used. And let me show you. The consistency, I didn't have to use a lot by the way. The consistency is pretty much like a pudding, you know. It's pretty much like a Shea Moisture consistency. It smells pretty good. This is a 12 ounce container and it tells you to basically um, put it on your hair and deep condition with it. And I have used it twice um, and so far I like it. Um, it says that um, it intensely conditions with hemp, tamanu, and manoi oils. And it says keratin and bamboo strengthen and fortify hair for healthy voluminous appearance. Garlic extract assists in preventing breakage. So I've used it twice and so far I like it. It's a very good deep conditioner. Um, my hair felt soft, it felt manageable. It was not dry like it was before, which was the whole reason for me trying this whole thing. Um, and it did feel um, a little stronger when it came down to um, you know detangling and, stuff and different things like that um, I pretty much just put this into my regular regimen have you seen my videos on my hair washing regimen I basically in lieu of my regular conditioner use this treatment mask and let it stay on for quite some time um, after washing so I use my regular shea moisture and then I put this on and deep conditioned and I could tell a difference in my hair up with the Indian hemp and tamanu grow and strengthen herbal custard um, I've used this more than twice actually um, I've used it when I've washed my hair because it does say that you can use it as a deep conditioner um, as a leave-in conditioner I'm sorry um, and it says it softens and thickens hair while increasing manageability um, it says it naturally reduces frizz it that it didn't necessarily do anything for frizz for my hair and that just may be because my hair is just gonna frizz it's just how it is it's just what it is I'm nature of my hair so I can't say that this decreased the frizz I can say that it did help my hair um, be a little bit more manageable when I was detangling um, I use, I've used this as a leave-in conditioner um, so I would detangle you know put this on and detangle with it I still did have to use a little bit more of my Shea Moisture just regular conditioner that I can leave into my hair or my Talia Wajid but um, I did use this um, and I found that it did help my hair manage manageability <laughs> it did um, let the you know the, the comb go through easier and my hair wasn't so tangled um, so I was happy about that I can say that I used it throughout the week um, after I washed my hair when I would just spritz my hair with the water and um, just kind of re-moisturize throughout the week I would put a little bit more of this on it and it helped um, and I can say that it does make my hair feel much silkier but it's really when it's wet not necessarily silkier when it's dry so I don't know what they actually meant as far as silkiness um, but when it's when my hair has been wet it does make my hair feel a lot more silky and I have noticed less shedding so I don't know if it the slip is just better when I'm detangling or what but I like this I think it's pretty good that I got was the grow and strengthen um, edge taming taffy and I'm gonna tell y'all a little bit goes a long way with this because okay there's hair in it hold on <laughs> okay yes yeah, hair in it because I used it um, it is very very thick 
Um, this is not your average like pomade. I don't know. Let me let me focus. This is not your average pomade. This is some. It is like super extra extra thick. I mean, it's like dough. It's like see, it doesn't even like separate off my finger. It's like for real some taffy. It's it's it's, it's like very 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 thick okay and what I found is that it does tame my edges um but <laughs> it, it tames my edges it has the same smell as the other one it tames my edges but it, my edges have to be damp um because I don't want to just be brushing my hair all hard and stuff just to make it you know go and I found that if my hair was dry if my edges were dry it's not like the curls pomade where I can just on dry hair put it on there and kind of slick it up it's much thicker than that so I found that I would have to just kind of spritz my edges a little bit not not soaking wet but just a little bit damp and then this would kind of melt into it and then it would slick my edges and it kept my edges slick all day and I haven't used hardly any because I don't have to reapply like if you put this on your hair on a Monday on Wednesday it's still gonna be there whenever you you know go to do something else to your hair um, I like it I don't know if I would necessarily buy it again but I don't hate it so I'm gonna give this a little bit more time so far um, you know just based off first impressions you know I really like the treatment mask and I really like the herbal custard these two so far get like two thumbs up um so there's my first impressions um i know that probably doesn't answer everybody's questions and stuff like that but i did want to go ahead and say you know I, I like it i would um i i don't regret purchasing it i don't you know anything like that i don't know if i would necessarily recommend it just yet and that's only simply because i haven't used it long enough to really say this is like thebomb.com so Thanks for stopping in on my channel, and I will see you on the next go-round. Bye.